Uh, I am Dr. Mushtaq Yaman from Rakel Herbs. Now today we are going to discuss about the herbal tea and the herbal teas are the beverages that are obtained from the decoction and infusion of the herbs, spices and other plant materials in hot water. Herbal teas have a strong medicinal benefits. They are used as anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, antiviral. So these herbal teas have a number of uses. Number one, they are used to boost up the immune system. They are used to refresh the body. They are also useful for the stomach disorders. They are useful for the heart problems and they are used to reduce the blood pressure. So there are a number of the benefits of these herbal teas. In this episode, we are going to explore the wild herbal teas that are found in the forest floors to use by the human This is a Flecorcia indica and belong to family Flecorciaceae. The leaves of this plant are used to prepare the herbal tea which is used to reduce the blood glucose level. So it is an anti-diabetic herbal tea. And you can chew the leaves of this plant to reduce the glucose level in the blood. Uh, this plant is known as Acacia modesta, which belongs to family Mimosaceae. Uh, this Acacia modesta bark, tree of this bark is uh, useful to prepare the herbal tea. And this bark is very useful for digestive disorder, stomach aches and number of the abdominal diseases. This is another herbal tea which is called as Anthemus nobilis. In English or commonly it is called as a wild chamomile. This tea is a very useful tea in the winter season as well as in the summer season. This herbal tea is basically used for insomnia, fever, cold because it is a rich source of flavonoid and polyphenols so it is one of the best herbal tea to treat a cancer as well. The herbal tea that is obtained from the dried leaves of the a wild mint which is called as mantha longifolia. This uh, leaf herbal tea is a useful therapy for allergy and it is also used for vomiting. It is also used for the colic diseases as well as refreshing uh, in our cold drinks and herbal tea. And we have to collect some other her herbal tea from the forest area. I would like to present one of the herbal tea. This is a plant known as Hibiscus uh, septerifa in English. It is called as Rosal and it is similar to the shoe flower. The flower of this plants are used as a herbal tea. So these flowers uh, can be used for a number of disorders. Uh, to reduce the blood pressure, to reduce the fats in the blood. It is also used as a liver tonic. It is one of the best therapy for the post nasal drip that is sometimes the people uh, feel the problems of rhinitis and the blockage of the nose so this herbal tea is a useful herbal tea in the winter season to reduce such type of the symptoms these are the dried flowers of hibiscus subderifa uh, to make a herbal tea a few flowers and then uh, put a boiling water You enjoy this herbal tea, which is just similar to the uh, cranberry. Uh, so 
sweetener like honey you put a small honey to make this delicious herbal tea some drops of the lemon So this herbal tea is a rich of antioxidant and it is used for number of diseases. Uh, I already told about the use of this plant. So the taste is very delicious. It is a similar to the cranberry fruit. You can use in the boiling water as well as in the summer season you drink as a cold drink as well. In this episode, we have discussed about number of the herbal teas that are collected from the wild forest. And these herbal teas we have discussed in episode. So our research group is also working on exploration of the herbal teas that are used for number of disorders. All the herbal teas are the rich source of flavonoids, alkaloids, phenolics. So they have a rich uses for medicinal purposes. You can see our link for the research publication and the scientific reports that we have published on herbal teas and herbal drinks that are used by a number of people around the world. I request all of you to cite this channel Miracle Herbs which contain a lot of treasures of the medicinal plants that are used for a number of disorders around the world. I hope you enjoy this episode.